Hey guys, I am at the dentist for this um, final wax try-in. Um, I am hoping that it is perfect so they can make my permanent. Um, this is a almost an hour drive when I have to come up here. So hopefully things go good. Fingers crossed. I will see you guys in a minute. All right, guys, one more thing before I start the uh, wax try-in video. Um, I want to tell you that I am doing a huge giveaway once I get to my goal of 1,000 subscribers. It's going to be random. I'm picking three people out of my subscribers. You each winner will receive a $25 gift card, a denture fit kit, and also a care package from me with various different um, denture products in it. So. Please subscribe. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe. If you watch my videos, please subscribe. If you do not have a Google account, it's very easy. Or a YouTube account, it's very easy. All you have to do is create a Google account or a Google, um, a Gmail account. And then when it asks you to log in um, at YouTube, you put your Gmail um, address and your password. That's it. Okay, let's get on to the wax train. Hey guys, I lost the sound on part of this video and I've, that's happened in the past and I've gone back and recorded it over. I can't do this on this. So you're gonna hear um, the sound through most of the try-in process, but towards the end, the sound cuts off. I'm very sorry. I don't know what causes this. Excited. Me too. Me too. We're almost to the end of it, aren't we? Well, you got to give me your hobby dominus. She, she didn't put a bid yet, did she? Uh-uh. Okay, cool. How's everything going? Really soft. That, I mean, I, I would never use toothpaste because it's so abrasive. Correct, because of the pumice. Right. These are in wax, you remember? I need to take the healing caps out. Yeah. She's going to do that. Oh, she's going to do it? Okay. Yeah, that'll knock my head out. Open. Okay. Rick, would you take the healing caps out for me, sweetie? Oh, you got some good <coughs> stats. Okay. Most of them come out really easy. There's one that... It's that one, isn't it? It's that one. Yeah. So... Any, any of the implants, any problems with them? No. Now, there's one over here. Yeah. The gum is... is yeah. uh, It but, irritates sometimes. Yeah, this one right here? Uh-huh. Yeah. I'm going to try to pop them. Ready? Uh-huh. I might need a little hemostat. There you go. I don't want you to swallow them. After they look first. Um, yes, sir. When I get the permanent, yeah. I mean, do do you think that tissue needs to be trimmed? It may. You have a very valid point. Okay. It may. Thank you. She was asking about this one on the right side. I put the other ones over there, Britt. Do you see it? Yeah. Uh, I had to do that to a patient I just put in, you know, caught these minis with. Uh huh. And she did, she had a, it was, it was her permanent and every time she put it down, the plastic mm. would, uh, would pound on it, you know, on the tissue. Dr. Peters. What? They stink. It's, it's the debris gets underneath the caps. Yep. Ah. Yeah, they do. It's like a temporary, uh, crown. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Where you take a temporary crown out and I'm not here to hurt you. I'm trying to find the gasket. You okay? Uh-huh. Okay, right down and close. Okay, a couple things we need to look at for her, okay? Yeah, tug the pressure. What do you think? It feels so big. Well, the pallet's still in there, and okay. the flange is really high up there still. I'm probably gonna have to trim the flange away. Okay. Let's look at the midline, ready? Okay, thanks. Midline on money, right? Mm -hmm. You agree? So? Mm hmm All right, bite down and close. Say 77. 77. Say 66. 66. Go E. That's okay. It's okay. Not gummy. What do you think? No, they're not gummy at all. White down. They look pretty good. They, they do. do. Nice. They do. They're wider than your lower teeth, but mm -hmm. you asked for that. I did ask yeah, for that because yeah. it's not.
Alright guys, here's the final. Here's the, the uh, watch try-in. Here's what it will look like without the pallet. So, what do you guys think? Alright, here's the comparison. Here's the permanent wax drying and final. Here's the temporary. I think. New soft reload. I'll be back to finish. Alright, hey guys. You, you just saw I did a side by side with the with the second wax try-in and my temporary my temporary that I got now is damn near perfect um, after I had told him we were good to go to make the permanent when I got up I pulled the wax try-in back out of the box and I looked at it I did a side-by-side -side with this temporary and the teeth are too small on that um, on that wax so I'm gonna have them make the teeth a little longer what on my temporary now this is um almost identical to what my natural teeth look like and that's what i want i am wanting this permanent really bad but i have waited this long and i want this permanent to be perfect so they are going to um have him work on it a little more and i'm coming back for another try in so we will get there all right but when you guys go for your for your wax try-ins you need to advocate for yourself don't tell them to go ahead and make the permanent just because you want the permanent done you need to make sure you are happy with what you see i mean i know this is a long process and i know that you want it done already but don't go with something just to be going with it you have to advocate for yourself um, you're pay, you're paying good money for this and this is something that you have to that has to function and that aesthetically you should be happy with so um, I don't have any adhesive in right now she did another soft reline but I just had her put some extra um, lining around the front where the um, implants are and so far it's staying in but you guys have a great day. Um, I won't upload again. Prob well, I'll probably upload again either tomorrow or Saturday. But I'm not sure what I'm going to talk about yet. So you all have a great day. And I will see you soon.